Hello and welcome to my last goal that I'm working here. This is my third one. My first one was exercise. The second one was computer term. And this one here is photo 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 editing. So in this program is called Photo Director, which this is is this one of the um, Cyberlink software application programs. And this is not the full version, but this is the trial version. There's other programs that's from Cyberlink that I'm not familiar with too, like ISO Viewer, Power Director, Power DVD, um, the Media Site, the Media Suite, which is, displays all of the um, um, digital media Cyberlink um, software from HP. So in this photo director here, um, this is what I'm doing to start my um, my slideshow for my family on September 26. The my mom's my dad's 10th anniversary passing and the rebirth of our new home. So this is what I do to create a slideshow for my um, my mom's um, party on the 26th of Saturday and um, this will show the slideshow of each slide so you add a bunch of pictures and then you put it to a slideshow so when you add pictures if you want to start a slideshow for yourself or for your family mainly slideshows is for family only can be for presentations too so there's you go into file you press import and you hit folders or folder or from camera so if you select photos um, you can select one photo at a time you can select multiple but some mm, some photos won't because you gotta check make sure it's um, JPEG or, or um, there's other formats too but mostly JPEG files are the recommended um, um, stuff so always um, watch what format of um, pictures you're putting into the photo side slow so you can like you can go in a import and select photos you select that so when you select office you select the folder then you will see a list of JPEG files and um, then you will import it into the uh, um, project so that you are doing so this is what I do and this is one of my goals so um, for people who are digital media freaks can um, put a slideshow together and then um, Uh, put it into a um, a disk. So, um, reason why this this picture is on here, and you have to put the actual name because these are serial numbers on the photo. So, um, as we, if you want to. And this is another program that I use. Um, it's called. Let's go down here. It's called. We don't have too many apps open. Let's close that. Because when you're on your computer and you're doing your work, you don't want to have too many apps running because you can slow down your machine. 
select an import source so you have to select a source of each picture you put in so um let's see how long here five minutes so let's see photo import so there's no photos to import so um trying to open it on my hold on it's a, another program that I'm familiar with but it didn't, didn't want to open hold on here oh three days so whenever you get a cyberlink HP software so and it, and it expires in a certain amount of days then we have to buy it See if it will open. Why oh, it's not opening? Okay, this is the one I did, but I might have to erase it. So, wait. This is the other one I just recently did, but I'm gonna change it around. This is called label make label label print from Cyberlink. This one is similar to um, the other one. So um, this is one of my goals here is to label the disk, which I'm trying to figure out how I'm gonna put the image onto the disk. So what? I might have to do it the manual way so um, because I don't have the money to buy a label so what I will have to do is to use paper use some kind of la label or something and put it on this somehow or, or draw it or whatever so um, but there's always a way so to figure out on how to paint and um, to um, to make the uh, um, project done so um, it's the one for the disk and the other one And the other one is called the CD cover one. So. Okay. Oops. So. This is the layout for the cover. As I said earlier, that I will have to get a sheet of paper and um, um, put get a um, some kind of DVD case and to put the label into the uh, um, this cover. So there's different styles to choose from. So you can either hit is that is a hit either left or right and select whether style you want to use and hit the background image to put it in the um, picture. So um, this is the label print. So to open a new one, you can hit new, open, save, save as, config, and help. So, um, this is the label for the disc, which I can get the disc cover. You will have to get DVD covers in order to put it, um, in the, uh, um, project. So I'm not going to do this one, but 
on the staff computer I will um, print out the uh, thing so um, so that way it will print the thing inside so photo director this is what I pointed my photos into the uh, um, slideshow so and in, a, in audacity what I did is I would put three sets of tracks and form it into one file so um, that it will work on the uh, disk let's see how many minutes we're in here Ooh, 10 minutes so this concludes the recording for today and I did three in a row and I will do more in the time being and next time will be stopped have a nice day and have a good week goodbye Two.